Namaste everyone. Namaste Dr. Meenakshi Garu. I am very grateful and feel blessed to be doing Gana Seva for this Hari Gana Amrita Music Festival for the Nada Arogya YouTube channel. I feel blessed to be able to listen to all the Vidushis and Vidwans here who have shared their Gana Amritam in this channel so far. Today, I'll be sharing two compositions. The first one is Yekkadi Manusha Janma Bekpina Palave Munnadi. This is a composition of Saint Anamacharya set to Ragam Bauli. And I learned this composition from Priya sisters. It's a beautiful composition and the way it is Priya sisters have sung it and also the meaning of the composition is something very profound. Anamaya says, what is this human birth? What is the use of taking the human birth? And I'm so confused with this Maya. I trusted you. Right? And the Charanams are very interesting. He says, I won't forget food. I won't forget pleasures of family. I won't forget the sensuous luxuries that I have. Oh Madhava, all this is because of your illusion. But I will forget good knowledge that I have learned. I will forget the human body secrets. Will also forget teacher and God. Oh Madhava, that is also your illusion. He says, I won't leave my sins and merits. I won't leave my vices. I will definitely not leave my excessive wants and desires. Oh Vishnu, this is all your Maya. But I will leave the six karmas that clean the body. I will leave the detachment. I will leave the rituals. And all this, oh Vishnu, is also your Maya. So I was truly touched and intrigued by this composition to understand what Maya is and why Maya was created and why Maya is even necessary in the creation. So I was imagining myself if I had the knowledge of all my previous births all my karmas that I have done and I have accumulated so far, will I be able to even live a, a second with peace? And so I realized that Maya is very necessary for us to put a veil over all those things which can distract us from being in the present moment. But the same Maya, like any other duality, has its own, um, I mean the way we use that Maya can be detrimental also. Like as Saint Anamacharya says in this composition. Maya was created so that we understand things and we grow in the spiritual path. But the same Maya, we are using it our way so that we can understand the world in a different way than it was meant to be and put obstacles to our own spiritual growth. That is how most of us are using. And in the end, he says, uh, 
having appeared as Sri Venkateshwara, you are the only present, one who reigns over me smilingly. Right? Is this an illusion too? So, that's the composition of Saint Anamaya. The next composition is an abhang. It's an abhang by Sant Namdev Maharaj and it is tuned to Raghav Durga. I have learnt this abhang from Srimati Kanakavalli Ji. Kanakavalli Ji is doing the great service of teaching bhajans and abhangs to many through her WhatsApp group absolutely free. And I am truly grateful to be able to learn this abham from Sri Nidhikantaraj. It says, Ananthan Sanatha Dinansa Dayala Bhaktansa Kripala Panduranga. So, in the previous composition, we figured out, you know, what is the, what can be the consequence of Maya. But how do we get out of Maya? In this composition, um, the way I am connecting these two compositions is that when we think of Panduranga, who is the Natha for all the Anathas, those who have nobody else, for them, he is the Natha. Dinansa Dayala, those who do not have anything, for them, he is the compassionate one. Bhaktansa Kripala, those who really pray with all their heart and do bhakti, he always obliges. And he is none other than Panduranga. In the Charanam, Namadev Maharaj says, Yegatu Vithala Majiya Mahera. Kripecha Sagara Panduranga. He invites everyone to come to Pandarpur to have the darshan of the Lord who is the ocean of mercy. And he calls Pandarpur as his mother's home. Again, a subtle, you know, all these great saints, whenever they have composed any composition, every time you sing, you get a different meaning, a different experience. And it's not by chance that they will use something, some words. Like here, he says, Pandarpur as mother's home. For all, all of us, we know what mother means to us. As soon as we remember mother, it is a, a feeling of love and compassion. And so, he says, everyone come to Pandapu. And in the end, he says, Nama Mahani Naza Haricha Vishwasa Jhalo Ase Dasa Janmo Janmi. I have so much faith, Vishwasam, in Hari that birth after birth after birth, I would like to remain at his service and as a servant to the Hari, to Panduranda. Thank you so much. <laughs>